Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hey there, guys. Matt D.S.A.B. here for Locker Gnome. De oh, hey, hang on. Just gotta wait for uh, Windows to boot up here. It's on the uh, Windows splash screen. So, uh, just got to give that a minute to pass this screen here. It's taking a pretty long. <laughs> be nice if there was some way that we could disable this, so we don't have to sit through this every time we boot up our system. Well, luckily, I recently found out how to do that, and I'm going to show you guys. All you have to do is open up your start menu, type in msconfig, hit enter. You want to go into the boot tab, and click on no GUI boot or no GUI boot. This will disable that Windows splash screen that comes up. Now, this will work in Windows XP, Vista, and Windows 7. Now, from this screen, you can obviously change a lot of other system settings, hence the name System Configuration, or MS Config. You can change the, the uh, timeout from when you select your hard disk or operating system from here. You can also change individual settings from each drive right here. For example, I want to do this on both drives. Right here, you can change the uh, timeout. For example, maybe you want to give it a little longer or a little shorter. I'll change that to 10 seconds. And uh, I recommend you guys go ahead, go to these settings. If you know what you're doing, of course, um, for example, you can go ahead, change uh, what starts up here. It saves a lot of time after your splash screen uh, when you finally boot into Windows. But like I said, if you don't know what you're turning off, leave it alone, guys. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. For me, this saved about 10 seconds while my system boot up. So I uh, hope that you guys found this helpful. This has been Matthew Sabia for LockerNome.com. I'll see you next week.